So we want the antigen phase to always be working for the most part. You know, that's when we're seeing the growth, we're seeing the length, we're feeling the little new growth, right? Mm -hmm. But when inflammation, in a sense, comes on the scene, it actually disrupts our hair growth cycle. So that marvelous antigen phase, it actually shortens that phase. So for example, on average, the antigen phase can be between three to five years. And this is just three to five years of active hair growth before that hair sheds from mm -hmm. the scalp, right? Mm -hmm. But if there's inflammation in the scalp tied to scarring alopecia, um, for example, you know, that three to five years can be um, cut down to maybe one year or one to two years. And sometimes mm -hmm. it's less than that. So you are getting less antigen phase hair growth. Mm -hmm. And it also um, pushes the hair into the, um, the talogen phase, that shedding phase. Mm -hmm. So hair that should be growing is actually shedding a lot quicker when there's inflammation. So that's kind of what's going on behind the surface.